Hi, I'm Carol George. Welcome to Off The Page. Bryce Courtney, Australia's most famous and biggest selling author. First there was The Power of One, made into a Hollywood movie, Jessica, The Great Mini Series, The Potato Factory, April Fool's Day, Story of Danny Dunn, I could go on and on. I caught up with Bryce in Melbourne to talk about his wonderful new novel, Fortune Cookie. Intriguing title, isn't it? Okay, so what's your new book, Fortune Cookie, all about? It's interesting for me because it's actually turned out to be a thriller. I was going to do this advertising in Asia type story and I've got a, ex, you know, I've got a young Chinese third generation Australian major character and then it just got out of hand and it became a thriller. But advertising, people think of it as a crass and sort of you know, capital L telling fibs uh, type profession but it isn't. It's a very tough communications environment and I like the tough environment when you when you've got something people don't want and you've got to persuade them that they do, you've got a job on your hands and, um, and I like that job. Why did you choose Singapore as a setting? It's, it's a wonderfully self-contained area. It's a small island, it's, it's had an enormously vigorous history, it's had a large Caucasian influence in British colonialism and a large Chinese influence. And it's unique in anywhere in Asia. There is nothing quite like it. Cookie is the name of your, it's his nickname of your main character. Tell us a little bit about him. Well, you see, I believe that the, the strength of Australia is that we're a polyglot community, community. Our strength isn't that we're white Caucasians. Our strength lies very much in the fact that we're a bit of everything. Uh, and so I wanted to take somebody who really was a bit of everything and an initial enormous outsider for two generations which was the Chinese population and and take a contemporary young Chinese guy who is as Australian as any of us in every sense and meaning of the word and put him back into where his ancestors came from and see how he handled that. I Look know. at this. It is, it is. You've got to take a photograph of this. You've just got to, you've got to see this. It's incredibly ornate, isn't it? It's the most wonderful dragon. Isn't yeah. it? And so it gave me a good chance to take the Australian characteristics and, and see what had actually happened, how the new country had transformed and changed a mindset. And, and that, I found that interesting. <laughs> Bryce Courtney, thank you very much for joining me on the book show. Oh, Sarah, it's a great pleasure. I have to know my characters and I won't write a book until I can speak to them absolutely intimately and know the darkest, darkest secrets in their mind mm. and, and, and be privy to it and know that I won't tell anybody until I start writing. The biggest selling author in Australia, Mr Bryce Courtney. Thank you. And of course, Fortune Cookie is a great love story as well. Yeah, I think love stories are everything, really. Um, love is such a difficult process. It is such a, and we all want it and we all need it. And uh, most of us screw it up on the way somewhere. Um, but it's, it's still inimical in, in, in the whole human emotion. Without love, we are nothing. And, and so, I always try to have a love story because I think stories are about love and loving and touching and feeling and emotionally getting involved and being upset and making all, doing all the stupid things we do. And sometimes not being able to have what you want. Well, almost never. <laughs> <laughs>